Wesley, I'm going to start with you at Verizon. What's it going to look like two to three years from now? We're all going to have our devices fully 5G enabled, secure. What's next? Right. What can we expect? What are these agencies going to be encountering two to three years from now? So two to three years from now, right? So we, we kind of break we break this down into kind of the vision, strategy, and execution, right? So we're, we've kind of got a little bit past the vision stage. We're right now in that strategy stage where we've been helping agencies define what they're going to do. And then we're, we're going to be hitting that execution phase in this next one to three years. And so one of the things that we've found, you know, with working with agencies is that, you know, they're moving a lot to just soft, everything being software defined. And so there's going to be a, a massive displacement of a lot of hardware out there. So, for example, we've been working with agencies that are, you know, as they're looking at zero trust, one of the first things they're doing is going, you know what, let me complete an inventory of my assets and let me start by focusing on the things that are going to be displaced. So the hardware that may be displaced as I start implementing these software defined solutions. So, hey, my physical web gateways may go away. My physical VPN concentrators may go away. Right. So I think you know, what we're going to start to see is this big transition away from a lot of the hardware based solutions. Right. And then moving more into right, the software defined realm. And that's going to start to make a lot of different changes the way as people consume. And then, of course, you know, I, I cannot go without saying, right, we're talking 5G. And so we're going to see right as agencies are adopting these software defined solutions, they're also going to be looking at different ways to get access to the internet. So instead of the traditional physical wired networks, there's going to be a more of a hybrid adoption, right? Um, and looking at things like 5G and even 4G LTE as well too.